Hello friends and welcome back to A Cozy Lifestyle with Clarissa Coward. I hope you're doing well. Today we're going to have some fun. Today I'm going to be doing my fall, pre-fall, kind of fall uh, coffee station, tea station for us and a two-tier tray as well. And what I'm showing you here is what I may be using uh, for the tier tray. There's so much stuff here. I know that I'm not going to use it all, but as usual, I laid it out and then I'll use what I use and put the rest away. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into this. So why don't you come on in and let's get ready for fall. So friends, as I said, what was there, I'm going to use some of it and some I'm not. But you know me, we're going to be begin the way that we always do. First, we have to clean up. Um, I haven't really touched the, the station for sp spring and summer um, after I put it together for spring and summer because what I've done is when I had a cup of tea I just heated my tea kettle on the stove um, but it's time to get it straight and that's one of the reason guys that I can add so many decorative items over here even though it's a coffee station and that's because we really aren't big coffee drinkers and we're tea drinkers and hot cocoa drinkers so as winter progresses a lot of the decorative stuff would have to go away and we have to have stuff here for cocoa but for spring and summer and for most of the time we just drink tea so um yeah i can use all the decorative items but as always like i said we're going to clean first and then we're going to start adding the pretty stuff and as usual you know it's going to be a lot of trial and error uh, i'm going to add some things and take them away and I hope this will give you uh, some inspiration to do the same thing. I am I know it's still warm outside, but I am so over the heat and ready for fall and the fall colors and just the cooler weather until outside it may be so warm. But in here, we're getting ready for a cozy season. So we're going to start with the tiered tray. And here I've added the, uh, the moss in the bottom to give it that kind of fall look and then I'll build from there now the, the little plate that I'm adding is all about grapes and you'll see that I will also be adding grapes to go along with that along with some other fun fall things as well so let's get started and have some fun decorating this tray but let me ask you this are you ready for fall are you just over summer or are you a summer person who would could live with summer forever let me know in the comments below so friends, I had to laugh at myself. Um, what I'm adding here, I think are uh, like corn shucks. Isn't it funny the things that we will buy uh, to to make our homes feel more, I don't know, um, I don't know, add that little country feel if you're into that. Uh, like the hay for fall and the, the corn shucks that I'm adding here. Now, they didn't cost me much. Got it from the dollar store, $1.25. But I just thought it was really funny, the things that we add. And for, you know, for the bling girls, you know, if you're into bling, you buy the, the, the faux diamonds and all of that. I just thought it was funny how we pull things together to turn our homes into spaces that we absolutely love. I guess we have to do that, huh, to make, to keep it cozy. Can you guys see here, have you noticed that I am still sticking to my black and white? That is just my, those are my signature colors and um, they just make me feel good. I uh, use a lot of that throughout the house. And that little uh, rolling pin that I'm showing you there, that's one of my DIYs. So is the Harvest Blessing sign, the other rolling pin. And there are quite a few little um, DIYs here. The little vase that I'm using there used to be a little jar. and. Uh, I needed something small for a tear tray, so voila, there you go. Um, guys, I hope you're enjoying this video. Uh, I am in my zone. I love doing tear trays. As a matter of fact, 
It's one of my favorite things to do. So friends, as you can see, once I get um, most of the larger items in place, then I begin to uh, fill in the areas with floral picks. I cut them off of the larger stems lots of times and um, I add them in between so there won't be any holes. Also for this one, because I'm using so many of the grapes, I've, I've added those in the, uh, in the areas where it would be empty as well. And as you can see, I'm giving you the thumbs up. We've made it. Okay, friends, so now that the tray is together, uh, it's time to go ahead and decorate the rest of this area over here. So what do you think? Um, I didn't go real full-fledged fall colors. I'm uh, thinking that I'm going to keep it a little lighter this year uh, throughout the house, wherever I decorate for fall. Um, of course, there will be some orange and some gold and some burgundies, but... Um, not as much as I normally do. And you'll see at the end here that some of this is really going to change um, as I get it done, which is always the case, right? Oh, and that little birdie there that was $5.99, he has a, a fragrance inside and it smells so good. I have a couple of those that I got from, I want to say, either uh, Marshalls or uh, Home Goods. And they smell good for a very, very long time. And the fragrance is inside. And, and they're pretty. So here we are. And you can see how things have changed, right? Look at that. Totally different than the way it started out. But hey, I hope you like it. I hope you were inspired. And by the way, I'm Clarissa Coward. And this is a lifestyle channel. And we do things like we're doing today. We do home decor, seasonal decor, uh, decorating, shopping halls. Uh, the occasional recipe and guys we do it all on a budget this uh, little thing that we're doing here today is a no spend and I'm going to do it I'll try to do a lot of that um, all of the florals and everything that you see here I have had I'm looking to make sure because I did do a little shopping haul the other day but everything here I believe is I've had in my stash so maybe the lighter florals maybe because I haven't shopped in a while and even mm. for the um, shopping haul they were things that I had for a while but that's what we do here and if you found something here that piques your interest or you like the way we do it why don't you hit that subscribe button below once you do hit that bell so you'll be notified of all upcoming content I have lots more to come also why don't you share the video with a friend or a family member. It really helps my channel to grow and I truly, truly appreciate it. Also friends, inside this tear tray and here on this uh, coffee bar are a lot of DIYs that I've done as well. So we also do a lot of that and there's more coming up for the holiday season. So come on back and join us. And if you're coming back, hey, I'm so glad you're sticking and you're staying in for my ride or dies. You know how I feel about you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I hope that it has inspired you and brought you some joy. And I hope that you will find something today that brings joy into your life. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.